Hi guys, today I want to show you how to use GLE Measure while keeping the hard edges on the object. For instance, the, there's the hard edge on the around corner. And I have another hard edges right here and right here as well. So let's go to Jelly Measure. Actually, this object has uh, some grooves. Let me turn it on. Like this. So, I wanna keep those grooves for UVs. Okay. So, to keep the grooves and hard edges. I wanna check keep groups here and detect edges and I will set the target polygon count as uh, around uh, 10,000 um, by now let's say 50,000 for now so if I click G measure Okay, now I got uh, reduced polygon with about 48,000 polygon. So, let's see. I have the hard edges here. And right here, right there. So, all the hard edges from the original mesh is still there. But the problem is, is it's still too high poly. So if you wanna go for lower the polygons, you should uh, run this GLE mesh again with uh, one of those uh, options turn on, right? So if I click half and keep the same options there and click the remesh again now I got uh, 23,000 polygons and it's kind of clean but the problem is it start losing the hard edges around the corner and right here as well right and right there too so if you run another Gilly measure with the same settings turn on, definitely you will losing the hard edges more, right? You get more smooth edges around the corner, which is you don't want it. Let me go back to the original mesh so what I did to solve the issue is I just turn on the keep groups and detect edges and for target polygon count to like 10 which is my final target polygon point and click zero measure Okay, now I got the reduced polygon with my final uh, polygon count, which is about 10,000. Actually, it's uh, 12,000, but should be okay to use it. There's a steel hard edge there, and right here, right? Compared to the original. I wanna go just click the Z, Ctrl Z go to go back to the original mesh and Ctrl Shift Z. Go back to the reduced polygon. So if you wanna keep the hard edges on your object, 
you need to just learn the G-Limation one time with your final holy count. Okay, I will finish this video here. If you like this video, please subscribe and hit the button like. I will see you next time. Bye.